Good morning. Okay, sorry if it's a little loud. That's my AC going. Um, I didn't film much of my first day of work back. I forgot. <laughs> But, um, yeah, first day back was interesting. Um, I definitely have to get used to wearing the mask all day. I mean, I was fine with it because I kind of trained myself during the quarantine to have it on, even though they say you shouldn't wear it so much. But because while at work, I just don't want to have a reason to take it off besides drinking or eating. So that was so interesting and it's kind of mind-blowing that people are out shopping right now because it's like where are you going where are you going it's a real question like where are you going and where i work everything is closed like it's ghost town so it's really weird um but yeah i'm getting ready to go to work i look so tired <laughs> getting ready to go for my second day <sighs> so i'll probably check back in with you guys later um kind of want to show you guys what i'm wearing and i'll probably show that later yeah okay bye <laughs> jermaine came to my job with flowers and i'm very grateful because these are so pretty sunflowers are my favorite sorry I'm excited hi guys how are you doing today on this lovely day look how excited I am can't even see my eyes <laughs> but yeah I just wanted to come catch up I don't have much to talk about honestly I just came from work and I'm kind of tired it was a long day like long so long that i brought a change of shoes long it was that kind of day and tomorrow i'm working at a different location not too happy about it but you know yeah that's all i'm gonna say i just don't want to do it but can we really talk about how pretty these flowers are guys Sunflowers are my favorite. I actually want to get one tattooed on my back. So, or my leg. I'm just undecided. Maybe my leg. I don't know if I want my back. But yeah. They're both very crusty. Oh, there's like a whole dog love fest happening right now. It's the cutest thing. I'm about to show you. Oh my goodness. Look at the love fest. How cute. Oh. <laughs> you oh. oh, you guys, so cute! Hi. <laughs> you think I didn't get a tan? Your buggy. I think she got a tan. Cause I don't think so. I think I got that golden right now. Um, I'm not golden, golden but I got that redness. She mad pale. I'm confused as to where I'm pale. Yeah. Negative. <laughs> Never. Yo, we was just over here in Brooklyn. Where we at? Brooklyn Bridge Park? Is that Brooklyn Bridge Park? We in Dumbo. Right? Yeah, I don't know. It's Brooklyn. <laughs> we took the ferry over from uh, the seaport over here. Got some food. It was being pretty greedy. Yeah, we got Shake Shack and we got Luke's Lobster. Y'all already know what this about. Lobster. <laughs> I had to get lobster. Bro. My man, my man, Nod used to tell me about this place. <laughs> he already know what this is about. And then what else we got? Shake Shack. It was being greedy today. I'm not even gonna lie to you. It was, I was being really, really, really greedy. I 
I haven't eaten all day, so this is my first meal, and I'm like, it was great. But I've been riding, like I've been, I've been working out, so I let me a little burger. And she got a, uh, what you got? Uh, my lobster roll. Lobster roll. But, um, no, but we was here talking about relationships, and, you know, we always have these conversations about, like, our relationship, like, what, what could make it better? What don't you like? You know? You know, just just to have that open communication, because I feel like sometimes like we'll let things go by and we don't bring it up, so we have like these touch bases, like it's work. Like we're always like, oh, so you know, you we good? <laughs> like do, you still in love with me? Like yes. you still love me? I love you too. But um, but we we were like just just communicating about that, and I feel like we always come up with like. You know what could like what's one thing that we can make better about us is uh, just continuing to have like patience communication both both but p patience and, and, and communication um but we always have communication yeah patience right so we um yeah because my patience my fuse oh well, yeah i just saw my hand oh well my fuse is very uh short I have a short fuse. Yeah, she does. I, I, I'm, I'm actually a little, a little bit more calm in that sense. So, um, you know, it's a balance. Yeah. What you looking at? Dogs. Uh, dog level over here. But, um, but yeah, like, you know, for, like I said, for us, we're like working on patience and, you know, more communication. Um, just to kind of better the relationship, being pretty open. Um, Always open. Yeah, like, like don't. Been super open since day one. You were saying. Um, yeah, sorry. I had to cut for a second. Um, what was I saying? Wow. Oh yeah. Uh, about your uh, not your temper, but um. Yeah, my fuse. You know what's so funny? I'm a pretty patient person for the most part. But I feel like when I get too compassionate, I want to say. I don't know how to handle it. Like, I get, I get angry. <laughs> so that's what I'm trying to fix. Because I'm just emotional. I'm a, okay, Scorpios, we're emotional. Very like very very but we act like we don't care so you know when you keep things bottled up i think that's my problem when you keep things bottled up your fuse is so short that you just explode at any time that you get angry because you're just holding it all the time don't do that it's not healthy i've been doing it my whole life don't do it yeah i mean i mean for me uh coming into this relationship i feel like i've i've you know, I've grew from my past relationships, so like I'm really open. I'm really willing to talk because um, I had I had a fuse, but um, I kind of calmed down now. So like, more or less for me, like I'm always trying to talk it out calmly, as calm as possible. Um, you know, using keywords like you know, like when I don't want no smoke, I'm like, listen, yo, babe. So what can we do? How are you feeling, babe? Like I'm always saying, babe. <laughs> You want to ease it out. You want to try not to uh, be so aggressive in the situation, but it's hard because you end up you're emotional in that in that moment. But you really got to catch yourself. So my thing is, don't drown and just um, continue in uh, just being open and not hiding anything from your partner. Because if anything is bothering you, put put that on the table. I sure do. But I'm emotional. I will call him back 20 times. I don't like how you said this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't, yeah, I mean, I, I'm a very, like, sometimes I feel like I may be talking too much. So that was my, my issue because sometimes she kind of, she doesn't want to speak. So I'm learning how to. That's how I calm down. That's my coping mechanism. If I don't speak, it's me calming down. 
right because but i feel like if i that's that's what i'm trying to fix because if i speak and i'm angry i blow up so if i sh if i just right, shut up right. I kinda but, like, but it's hard because it, it's like that's why you got to find that that that, that common ground because yeah happy medium common ground because sometimes i want to talk like you know in that moment i don't want to hold it up and she doesn't want to talk so you know sometimes on both sides on both sides we all take l's because i take l's she take l's because of you know you put i might put her feelings first and be like you know what i don't i'm i'm just i'm not even gonna say anything and it hurts because sometimes i want to talk but um you know overall you know that's a relationship if you win some you lose some you know <laughs> You can't win every argument or every fight. Um, and I you, hate taking L's. Right, but you, you but know, you, but you I have, have to, to. You gotta. Of course. You have to listen. I do. Okay. Wait. You huh? have to listen. No, I'm just saying oh. you have to learn how to listen. <laughs> now you do. I'm just saying. No, I know, I know. I'm, I'm just saying, like. Me yeah. Look at her. No. Like I'm just letting her know, like. You gotta listen. You gotta listen. I gotta listen too. Like, for me, I have to. I actually, you know, like when your 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 teachers reading something, like you gotta listen, yeah. like you gotta really listen because sometimes you think you're listening and you're not really listening. You know, a lot of things go over your head, and and also just being open to um your 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 your, your partner's feelings because certain things don't bother me, and we get into it all the time about that because I'm like that like that's not a big deal to me, but it's a big deal to her, and then. You know with me that's a big deal so you know we try our best to like because it's hard because sometimes i'm like yo that's not a big deal to me but i have to catch myself and yeah, i have to really listen and try to you know something's a big deal to you and it might not be a big deal to me i gotta like okay it's a big deal to him so let me let me fix up basically basically that's what i'm saying right so we have to be considerate of each other has to be equal yeah be considerate of each other listen we're not out here trying to give advice or anything we're just like you know we're just talking yeah. um to our friends and family or whoever else is watching um because how long we've been in a relationship over a year. yeah like over a year now so we um, have some work to put in but we're putting in that work yeah so um it's like i said it's really difficult but uh you know when you're in love and when you're like invested and dedicated, you know, just keep it going. So, um, you know, this was just, we was just we was just vibing over here. We was just like talking about like relationships and like a lot of future stuff. So, um, leave some comments. Yeah. Um, let us know how we doing. We're still new to this, but um, but it is but it is but it is fun um, to come and uh, talk to you guys. Um, it's fun, you know. And leave comments of what you want to see on the channel. Yeah, like we want ideas, like yeah. you know. You want advice? Anything, like anything, like anything, like anything, Style. anything that right, anything that could make, anything that could make, uh, you know, our vlogs better. I'm open for you know anything, but I'm I'm I really like communicating, like really speaking, so you guys can see us, and uh, you know. Try, we try not to stay away for too long, but um, definitely gotta cook some stuff up, and um, you know, in our busy schedule, but we gotta make it work because uh, a lot of people have been asking us like, "Oh, you need to vlog, no, you need to vlog, no." So yeah, guys, we, I mean, it's not, it's not a full time thing yet. It's still, still it's, gotta go to it's, work. It's a personal thing, yeah, right now, and and I mean, honestly speaking, it's really just a personal thing because we do this naturally. I always say that. And it for fun. Like I start, you know, it's so funny. I've been vlogging for a long time. I just never actually posted any videos. I have, I have vlogs in my phone that are at least two years old. Um, so yeah, I just never made the leap, and I finally did. So leap ideas because I actually enjoy vlogging. So I want you to tell me what you want to see. I think I think we were. Um we just have a lot of ideas, but um, I think one one thing that we're probably gonna sh you know showcase is um, uh, fashion. Well, she is. She's the flower, and I, I can't dress. Um, I suck. Um, <laughs> look at her shirt. She was hype. 
She was so hyped to show y'all her show. She said, yeah, I'm ready. Yeah, that was a lot, dude. Mama. <laughs> but um, we're definitely like going to cook up some stuff. She has a lot of ideas with the fashion. So maybe if you guys want like fashion tips, I don't know. And maybe she might surprise y'all. Erica Badu will see this. I want you to be my doula. If you ever see this, mama, or if one day she might see it. When I have a child, I want her to be my doula. I want to have a natural birth. That's besides the point. We ain't talking about that. But you going off the? I'm going off the rim, but I want her to be my doula. Anyway, um, <laughs> we're gonna check out. Uh, hope everybody's good. Continue staying safe, healthy, uh, healthy blessed. Um, Black. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already know. Black. <laughs> but no, everybody stay safe. Um, and uh, just, you know, stay blessed. Um, and subscribe if you haven't. Yes, I know a few of y'all just be coming and y'all ain't hit that button. But hit the button and comment. And hit the notification because it will definitely help letting you know when we post. I'm trying to do it weekly now. So I'm really trying to make it strictly weekly. Um, if I do decide to post more than once in the week i'll announce that but just hit the notification button i'll announce that all right guys so y'all be good see y'all soon peace and blessings good evening from me and leah i'm trying to get her to sit still because i just wanted her to vlog with me for a little bit but I just don't want to stay but anyway just got home not too long ago just washed my face and my whole skincare routine. If you guys would love to see a video on my skincare routine, let me know because I have a routine down packed right now and it's working for me. And I'm also taking skincare vitamins. I did mention that and I want to show you guys the vitamins. So yeah, yeah. You know what's so funny? My favorite part about coming home is actually washing my face. Like. <sighs> doing the whole routine it's great it's great if like if i'm a little red it's because i just washed my face but my face feels so nice and clean you want to say hi good evening did you eat did grandma feed you uh that's a no don't like to me Leah is very talkative, but only around me and my mom. It's so funny. What? <laughs> you know, I really wish I knew what she was saying. Because I know she's saying something to me. I know you're saying something, but I'm not sure what it is. I want to say that she is telling me she wants a treat. You want a treat? Yeah. Want a treat? But yeah, anyway. Um... I'm going to have some soup because I have soup in the fridge and cause I was about to order Burger King. I'm still contemplating because I've really been craving a Whopper, but it's kind of late, but you know, I haven't been eating that much lately, so I'm trying to force myself to eat at least once one full meal in a day. I know it's, it's like, it's about to be 10 o'clock at night, but... <laughs> I'm really hungry right now, um, and that's a good thing because I haven't been that hungry, so, yeah, <laughs> I need to eat, but anyway, I'm rambling about absolutely nothing, I just want to come on here and show face, um, if you guys haven't seen Jermaine in a while, you will, I was actually with him earlier, he's home, I'm at my home, so, yeah, anyway, see you guys later, do you want to say goodnight, Leah? I want to turn this way, but if I turn this way... Might not be good. Quick. <laughs> Say goodnight. Say goodnight, guys. That's not nice. Say goodnight, guys. Goodnight. You want to say goodnight? I want to see she'll do it. Say goodnight. Wait. <laughs> All right, goodnight, guys. <laughs>